I was just thinking, um, I don't think it was chemical imbalance and I don't think it was just drugs and alcohol. I think it was more that I lived an incredibly American life that if I could achieve X and Y and Z that everything would be okay. There's a part in the book about people jumping out of a burning skyscraper not because they're afraid of falling anymore, it's just because the alternative is so much worse. So then you're invited to consider what could be so awful that jumping to your death seems like an escape from it. And I don't know if you have any um, experience with this kind of thing, but it's worse than any physical injury. It might be what they were referring to in the old days as a spiritual crisis, like when every axiom of your life is false and that your life is nothing and you are nothing and, and everything is an illusion and you're better than everybody else because you can see that it's an illusion but you're so much worse because you can't fucking function and it's really horrible. And I don't think we change. I know there are all those same parts of me. I just gotta find a way to not let them drive. You know? Anyway. Good night.